Most people know that positive reinforcement-based operant conditioning is being used to teach complex behaviors to performance and working dogs. It's also very appropriate training for pet dogs. The science behind operant conditioning was first described in the 1930s by B.F. Skinner. For our purposes, the trainer uses an event marker to identify a particular behavior we want repeated. The clicker serves as both a camera and a paycheck. As a camera, it allows marking of behaviors which are too fast or too awkward to reward during the behavior itself or when the behavior is performed at a distance. As a paycheck, it tells the subject that reinforcement is coming for the marked behavior. We can use operant conditioning to create a series of successive approximations toward the final desired behavior. As with all organisms using all methods of training, reinforcement drives the behavior toward what we want. An advantage of clicker training is that the dog is thinking through the behavior and in many cases can actually learn new behaviors more quickly. The dog is working proactively and can respond to the environmental cues instead of relying upon someone else always paying attention and giving commands to the dog. Any reinforcer may be used to create new behavior. Many people use food rewards, but today we're going to look at a dog learning a new skill without a piece of food in sight, just a new favorite toy. We knew what we were doing. We thought he was a border collie. Who knows what he is? He's just a black dog. <laughs> but something that could direct his energy. And it seemed like the style of training you were doing was, was definitely more focused on, on the dog. I mean, we want our dog to be a good member of our family, a productive member of our family, not such a distraction when people come over or something like that. So that's what we were looking for. Get it! With Murphy, we started by reviewing the game of tug and release. So we knew that we had that reinforcer available to us and he wasn't going to be confused or put off by us taking that reinforcer back to get another repetition. <laughs> then access to the toy became contingent upon Murphy being somewhere to my left side. Anywhere to my left was clickable, he had to be on my left in order to get the toy. After that, we began to ask Murphy to move alongside that left hand position in order to earn the toy. With both temperature and humidity in the high 90s, Murphy was starting to slow down. He was still very willing to come out from his water and shade breaks to play this game, but we didn't want him to overheat. So we put him away for a few minutes and brought out another dog, Levitine, to show how this healing work would progress. Yeah. And that's exactly, that's exactly what watch is. Lave is 17 months old, which makes her about 10 months older than Murphy, so she's had a little more practice. But you can see how she really understands that being in that left-hand position with her eye up on her handler will result in the click and then the toy. Murphy returned from his break refreshed and ready to play. He obviously remembered that being in the zone at my left-hand side would produce the click and then the toy. Even though it began to rain from a cloudless sky as the humidity became too great for the air, Murphy was enjoying his lesson enough to want to continue. This is a dog who will have no trouble continuing to a high quality, reliable healing behavior. Huh? You notice how good he walked back I with know. you? I know, it was awesome. How great was that? <laughs> we can already tell a difference after just a few classes uh, at home. We work with him quite a bit too, but I think whatever we've learned is really helping us. He's a much calmer dog. We had friends over last night and it was, it was, was night and day from three months ago. <laughs> he was very excited when they arrived, but with the techniques we learned here, we could also tell them how to uh, react to his actions. And two, three minutes later, he was just laying on the floor. So, Chewing in his calm. That was great. 